Up for sale now vehicle max, we have a 2009 Honda Odyssey EXL with RES. What that means is the EX model with leather and the rear entertainment system. It's got uh, dual power doors, power tailgate, alloy wheels, four brand new tires that we just put on it that have less than a mile or two just back and forth to the tire shop. Tan leather interior, uh, privacy tinted glass, roof rack, and a number of other options that I'll get into in just a minute. Car has a clean title and a clean Carfax you can view right now for free at our website, vehiclemax.net. Car has no dents, no hail damage, no love bug damage, uh, no major touch ups or scratches of any kind. Also, if you're watching this video not a trader, let me tell you, it will cut off for three minutes. If you want to see the full 10 minute video, please visit our website, vehiclemax.net. We are located at 3200 Northwest 37th Street, Miami, Florida. 33142 is our zip code. We are open Monday through Friday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., Saturday 9 to 5, and we're always closed on Sundays. We have been in the car business since 1992 and have sold over 30,000 cars. We are an accredited member of the Better Business Bureau with an a rating. You can check that out right at our homepage. There's a, a clickable link with a three B's on it for the Better Business Bureau and it'll take you to their website and show you our rating. Uh, let's go ahead and move on here and then we'll get it started. I'm gonna go ahead and stop at every wheel and tire. Uh, the wheels are in great shape. They have uh, no corrosion, no curb rash, nothing like that. And again, four brand new tires just put on. Let's go ahead and uh, get it started. Let me show you the power doors, how they work here from the remote. You can do it from inside or from the remote, by the way. Okay, it's uh, two passengers in the front, three in the middle, of course you're not going to put a big guy in the little chair, and then three more in the back, so it's a total of eight passengers, and as I said, it's got the DVD here, the moonroof, and shades on the side, I'll get that all working in just a minute for you. Go ahead and uh, close this door here, you can close it also with a remote, not just open it. Let's open the tailgate now. It beeps and also flashes twice to let you know it's about to open. Okay, the rear row seat folds completely down to the ground flat. Okay, so it, uh, in case you need to go into like cargo mode, gives you plenty of space. Let's go ahead and close the tailgate now, and let's open the power sliding door on the right. The car has only 38,000 miles. It is still in the manufacturer's warranty of five years, 60,000 miles on the powertrain. The bumper to bumper warranty has been exceeded by miles. Okay, nice and clean on the inside. Okay, I believe this unit has curtain side airbags here on the middle post, curtain side airbags here on the front post, and there's also, I think, another set back here on this rear post right there and one more in the back which I'll show you when I open up back there again so let's close here we've got power seats on both sides not just the driver's side this is the passenger side here let me go ahead and get inside get it started show you the DVD the moonroof all that good stuff okay before I sit down I'll pan over the seat power seat and power recliner we also have airbags here on the seats. So there's a total of four side airbags per side, curtain side airbags, plus this one here makes it five per side, a total of 10, plus the two front airbags, a total of 12 airbags, okay? The door panels are all tan with a chrome handle and the charcoal gray um, uh, trimming around the window switches. Of course, it's got power windows, power door locks, cruise control, tilt wheel, has uh, heated mirrors, okay? Uh, let's go ahead and sit inside. You can also open the um, tailgate by using the switch and you can open the power doors by using these. This is the moonroof switch and I'll go ahead and get that going now. <coughs> oh, you know what? Before I, I misspoke, I said 38,000 miles. It's got only 35,800 miles. Maybe that's where I get confused. Let's go ahead and... Um, Oh, well, let me show you a DVD. We already got a DVD playing back there. You can also open the doors by just pulling on the handle. You don't have to uh, use the switch if you don't want to. 
right there is a factory DVD playing a movie. Okay, this is um, the remote. It actually uh, kind of nuzzles in there, and then you can pull it out and use it from outside of there. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and move on to the front here. I'm gonna leave the door open for now. Let's lower the volume so you can hear me talk. Has the uh, WMA MP3 with the XM uh, six uh, disc CD changer. Okay. Let's go ahead and open the moonroof. Switches over here, as I said on the side. Oops. All right. <clears throat> All right. And let's go ahead and close it so you can see it's a glass moonroof. It is tinted, but it has the um, the hard cover that you can slide to block out the sun completely. Okay. Let's go ahead and leave it open for now. All right. And here's where you put your uh, your DVD. For the to watch a DVD back there, there's a couple of power outlets here for your cigarette lighter or cigarette lighter adapter. Heated seats with two uh, positions of high and low, of course, on both sides. We've got uh, triple climate control. Let's go ahead and turn on the AC here. Let me lower the fan so you can hear me talk. All right, uh, so you can see here we got both sides on low, meaning that's as cool as it gets, but. Uh, we can change it by putting it, say, from uh, where it was before to like 65, and this one stays on low. So they're independent of each other. Not only are they independent of each other, but the back is also independent. You know, uh, they they can control their own temperature. Okay, you turn it off. See, so I'm going to put the driver's side at 65, the rear at 70, and we can keep this one here to say at 60. So triple climate control. Go ahead and put them all at, now down to low. Here in Florida, most of the time, so you're going to have the AC. Okay, and let's go ahead and turn off the rear. And let's go ahead and turn off the AC altogether because today is actually a nice and cool day. All right, uh, let's go ahead and put some music on. Keyword, nightlife. If we could find some besides commercials, seek over here. Sounds great by the way. On the steering wheel you got remote controls to the stereo. Uh, you can change the volume, change the station, and change the mode. And what I mean by mode is going from AM to FM to CD player to the DVD player or to the auxiliary which is the one for your uh, so you can plug in your iPod there so you can listen to your iPod music. Uh, automatic transmission with overdrive right here. The overdrive switch is here. Okay, we got a nice uh, rear camera on the rear view mirror here. Uh, right now it's beeping because of my driver door and so it's just lighting door is open. But just to give you an idea, when you put the car in reverse, the camera comes up there in full color. It's not very big, but it's uh, all you really need. Okay, neutral. And drive. And it's, it's still beeping because I said you got two doors open. As you can see there, there, the driver door and the left sliding door are open. Um, car is running right now. Let's go ahead and rev it. And the reason I'm doing that is just so you can see that the car is running and that there are no check engine light on, no airbag lights, no service engine soon, no maintenance due, nothing. The only lights that are on are the two little lights there for the driver door that's open and the sliding door is open. Matter of fact, let's go ahead and close that sliding door. Uh, it's here. As soon as it closes, that light will turn off. Okay. And then the other light is the seatbelt light because I'm not worried my seatbelt to shoot a video. Uh, I panned over the dashboard while the music was going to show you that there are no cracks or burn holes or stains or it's not lifting up anywhere. Same thing with the steering wheel and the seats and the carpeting and the headliner. Matter of fact, there's no burn holes anywhere on the seats, door panels, whatever. N no burn holes at all and there's no odor of smoke whatsoever. So it looks like the previous owner was definitely a non-smoker.
Just a pleasant odor inside the car. All right, I'm panning over the leather um, steering wheel so you can see some perfect shape with no damage or scratches or cuts or anything like that. Uh, cruise control over here. Uh, what else am I going to show you here? Uh, we're showing you the power tailgate, sunroof open and close. This is to tilt it and these are to open the sliding doors. Uh, the windows, the driver window is automatic, meaning one touch. You don't have to hold the switch for it to go up or down. Okay, that's what I mean by that. The other ones are just regular. I'm not going to waste time opening that and closing that. Uh, okay, that's your rear view mirror there. Um, this is your home link. This is so you can program your garage door or gate where you live so you don't have to carry the remote with you. Here is uh, storage for sunglasses. Oh, you can also put it here and use it as a mirror so you can watch the kids in the back. Okay. Vanity mirrors with lighting. Same thing on the driver's side. Okay. Uh, what else here? See, we get just some storage here. This pulls out into a cup holder. Okay, um, this center section here, you got a cup holder and a tray, and then more cup holders back here, but it also has a handle down here. I don't know if you can see it from there. Well, this thing comes, does this come out? No. Uh, and then you can flip it down so you can go back and forth to the back through there. And you just pull the handle back up here and lift it up. So this, uh, you can move it around if you have to. Uh, <clears throat> uh, this is for your top tier here for like magazines and uh, uh, newspapers. And I can barely reach it from here. Let me move this out of the way. There we go, that's better. And there's your glove box. And in here we got uh, two headphones. Uh, what else? The owner's manuals way down there. Everything that you need is there. Remember the remote is um, it's integrated into the roof and it pops out if you pull it out. Let's go ahead and turn off the car. And let's open both sliding doors so we can get a better look inside the car. While they're opening. And uh, we'll open the tailgate as well. Oh, maybe it didn't hold it long enough. Okay, let's try that again. There it goes. Okay, um, I don't know if you're able to tell here, we have these window shades that uh, you can bring up or down to block out the sun. Um, to gain access to the rear, just lift up here and then the seats comes forward and you can get back there. Uh, in the rear row, all the passengers have an over the shoulder belt, including the middle row passenger, which uses that one there that comes off the roof. The rear passengers have their own AC vents, as well as uh, map lights. Okay, the middle row passenger uses, up here the middle row passenger, this one here, uses this belt coming off the roof. And again, they got their own AC vents here with their own map lights. Oh, I think it's because the door is open, but anyway, um, all this stuff works. Uh, and then you get your AC vents over there for the passenger side. Uh, nice and clean, it's got all the carpets, okay. Which actually buckle down here with like a... Uh, like a clip on down there so that they don't come off. Look like whoever had this car didn't have kids or if they did it were adult kids because it's nice and clean back here. Kids love to stick their feet on here and stretch this out and sometimes it just hangs or even detaches from excuse me from the side. Okay let's move on to the uh, the uh, cargo area back here. All the tail lights are in perfect shape, no cracks, no damage, no uh, they're nice and clear, they're not hazy. As I said, this flips down completely into the ground. And now I'm going to show you the fourth airbag here. The cur fourth curtain side airbag. Alright, so we have one in this post, one in that post right there, one in the front post there by the driver's head, and one up in the front by the, wind, uh, by the visor. So we got a total of uh, four curtain side airbags, two seat airbags, and the two front airbags is a total of 12 airbags. So lots of safety in this car. To close the tailgate, we can do it from here. <clears throat> rear wiper, rear window defroster, and of course, you know, privacy tint all around. And these are also in perfect shape with no damage or cracks or scuffs. All the emblems are nice and clean, the chrome is not peeling on them. Let's come back here, and uh, this one here also has the side shade, which is uh, all you got to do is detach it from the top there and it slides into the doors if you don't want to have it on. 
vehicles equipped with uh, child lock protection. You flick the switch open and then the kids will not be able to open the door from the inside. You will have to use the outside handle. And to just undo it, just flick it back the opposite way. All right, um, I think we're good to go here. I don't think there's anything else I need to show you. Front door panels, perfect shape. Nice and clean all around. I mean, no, uh, no excuses here. The leather's in phenomenal shape. All right, um, that's gonna do it for the video in this unit. If you have any questions, feel free to call me. My name is George at 305-218-5462. Let me remind you that we're located at 3200 Northwest 37th Street, Miami, Florida. 33142 is our zip code. Um, open Monday to Friday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Saturday 9 to 5 and always close on Sundays. Um, if you require financing, we have excellent rates for good credit and we also have special financing for not such, such good credit. We can pretty much get anyone financed, okay? If you are concerned about financing and you'd like to go ahead and get pre-approved because you live a long distance away and you're concerned about making it and drive for nothing, uh, on our website, there's a, right on the homepage, vehiclemax.net, there's a uh, silver tab that reads apply for credit. Click that, fill it out completely, click submit at the bottom of the page, and uh, give us a call so we can retrieve your application and uh, get you pre-approved. I'm going to go ahead and thank you for watching our video at vehiclemax.net. Thank you.